He's like a, a dark-haired super being, and I'm just an overgrown kid who pretends to be other people for a living. <laughs> so... I was amazed and delighted and surprised. I am the same guy who had lived through the events of Avengers Infinity War, and I thought, well, he, that felt pretty conclusive. It was such a pleasure and a, an honor to get to, to get him back out there and, and take him on a new adventure. You know, it's really interesting. I love the idea that the audience might have more information about Loki than Loki. That puts him on the back foot immediately and it was kind of dramatically quite rich territory to explore because then you have characters who don't know what's going on. It kind of, their confusion and uncertainty can always be quite entertaining. I had to do a bit of rewinding in my own head um, to uh, remember where exactly Loki is when we meet him again in the series. But yeah, it was fun. You'll see, you'll see. mischief that's followed him around for so long and I looked it up in the dictionary and, and I think in the dictionary it says an inclination to playfulness and I love that chaotic um, untrustworthy yes possibly sometimes not what anyone needs yes but nevertheless playful always playful if he put himself in a play he'd want the play to be about him the tragedy of Loki, Prince of Asgard. <laughs> if I were to put him in a play, The Tempest would be fun, I guess, wouldn't it? Shakespeare's The Tempest, there's a lot of magic in that. Um, I think Prospero would have fun with Loki. Well, um, I'm not a god, <laughs> so, uh, so there's one big difference. Um, there are lots of aspects of his internal experience that I have to kind of imagine. It is often an extraordinary realization to sort of understand that I've been playing this character for so long. In the end, he's like a, a dark haired, super intelligent, charismatic super being. And I'm just an overgrown kid who pretends to be other people for a living. <laughs> so. But I admire his playfulness. Wherever you go, it's just death, destruction, the literal ends of worlds. I know. Original series now streaming only on Disney Plus.